it. So it's Sunday and there's a lot of people on the sidewalk. I'm gonna walk to the Mariners game and hang out with a buddy for a little while. Uh, and I'm not gonna use the unicycle because you get to me look, people stop you, questions, not today. Pronto bikes? You, you were pony bikes. <laughs> yeah. Pronto bikes? Tell me about pronto bikes. Pronto bikes. We rented them. Eight dollars for 24 hours. Yeah. But you have to check it in every 30 minutes no matter what. Otherwise you get charged like an extra fee. So we took bikes out for three hours to Ballard and then and you 70, got charged $75. Oh, it's like, oh, it's 19 for the day or something like that. It was $8. Oh, yeah. Sunday and we're downtown Seattle right on the water and we're gonna do some dinner and a little bit of the Ferris wheel over there somewhere for you guys So the verdict on Anthony's is, it's good. Good, not great. It's not great. And I'm kind of, I'm not, not super picky, but it's not, a, it's not cheap and it's not great, but you can always probably get a seat and the, the view's great, the ambiance. You wanna sit by the water? I would say for, if you have out of town guests, it's perfect. You yeah. Sit by the water, you can see the Why not wait? sights. Sunset, the Ferris wheel, the waterfront. Good for that. It's close to my place, my Airbnb. And uh, the food is pretty good. Alright, so we are in the big Ferris wheel and down near the waterfront. Beautiful. It's great. Uh, it's 15 bucks per person to go around three times. And I think they're stopping right now. We're actually at the top, which is pretty lucky for us. <laughs> Check out that view. Boom, nice sunset, perfect. Great little touristy thing to do with your fam. It's cool. 
This little booth probably seats six people comfortably. Uh, some air and a help button and some, all sorts of things. Feels a lot safer than a normal Ferris wheel, which normally I'm terrified of Ferris wheels, but even though it rocks a little bit, it's you feel secure. Seems pretty cool. We didn't have to wait that long. I suggest uh, it's a great tourist activity if you're coming to Seattle and just wanted to actually check out the sunset or be down by the waterfront and experience this great city. All right, IMAX 3D. Mad Max. It's gonna be pretty cool. Put the glasses on. Yeah, and then we look good. Alright, Mad Max 3D. <laughs> Pacific Science Center, right next to the Space Needle. Very short walk from downtown. <laughs> It was uh, way more gory than I thought it was going to be. Uh, definitely worth being in 3D, but it's crazy. It was, yeah, it was, it was a little much, but shot well, cinematically very interesting. But uh, be prepared for a little bit of uh, blood and guts. So that's me concluding my Sunday, and uh, just take it easy and uh, be easy. <laughs>